Did you know there is a railway entirely powered by water? Linton and Lamoth Flickler Cliff Railway opened in 1890 and is the highest and steepest water powered railway in the world, raising 500 feet from Lynmouth to Linton. As we go up, let me explain how the system works. A funicular railway is a type of railway where the two carriages are connected by a long loop of wire. So when one carriage comes down, the other carriage is pulled up with a pulley at the top to transfer the energy through. An electric or fossil fuel motor could be used to power this pulley, but in this case, it's entirely powered by water. When one of the carriages reaches the top, it opens a valve which fills the bottom compartment of the carriage, a tank, with 700 gallons of water. This adds a significant amount of weight to the top carriage, about 3,100 kilograms. When the brakes are released, this additional weight pulls the carriage down the hill and in turn pulls the other carriage at the bottom of the hill, which has had its tank emptied, up the hill. It's not a completely vertical hill, it rises at the angle of 57%. I will put the figures in the comments below if someone would like to do the math about how much energy is being generated. Once we get to the top, the brakes are engaged and the passengers disembark. The top tank is then filled and the bottom tank is emptied. This cycle repeats for every journey. Linton is a nice quiet town on top of the hill with some touristy streets and great views down to the coast below. If you would like to visit the Linton and Lamoth Flickler Cliff Railway, it is open from 10 o'clock daily. Each journey costs £3.50 per person per journey, and an additional pound if you'd like to bring your dog. There is plenty of parking available, but with more parking at Lynmouth rather than Linton. So it's best to park at the bottom by the coast and then get the train up, explore, and then get the train back down again. Tickets can be purchased by the railway, so no need to book in advance.